Good morning, Moose. Hello. 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 Morning. I don't even know what that accent was. Anyway, uh, it seemed that a lot of you guys liked the What I Eat in a Day videos. It's very like a keto thing. Shout out to Married to Keto. Uh, so we figured we would do that today and also mix it with like, a vlog. It's Sunday. I have no idea what we're doing today. But um, let's show you. I just made my coffee, but, I, but Jarrell was making his. So I was like, babe, wait, stop. We're going to show you Make how coffee. he makes his. Yes. BPC. Hi, I'm Jarrell. And I'm David. I am 34 years Right, so we started. Jarrell just goes, "Should we use a new butter?" I'm like, "We ain't got <laughs> no like new butter money." The, the final like, Child, like we are, this is not Rachel Ray. They know this is not a <laughs> test kitchen. They know this is not a set. But um, I got our we got our Kerrygold butter here. Yes, <laughs> Irish. Oh Kerrygold. my goodness, we're you're gonna need a new butter soon. Yeah, we're gonna need a new one. But you're um, drop this on I the floor. Don't put a whole lot. Um, I just want to cut like a little sliver. Mm-hmm. Well, mm -hmm. More than that, actually. I'm gonna say a little, a little bit with more. <laughs> so there we go. Okay. okay, this is how much goes in About there. About that much with the butter, and we also have um, coconut oil. Yeah, we do. That we use. Um, this is organic coconut oil, simply nature, but it's also melted. I don't know. It doesn't feel like it's hot in here, but it's hot. It's melted. We're, this is what this is what your cocoa. This is what your coconut oil, not cocoa butter. <laughs> that is something that goes on. Our skin. <laughs> uh, this is what your skin, your coconut uh, oil looks like when you live in Los Angeles. <laughs> do you see this? It's melted. So usually I do like a, um, a spoonful of it, but with this, I'm just gonna pour it and. It actually kind of makes it easier. I'm not it gonna makes lie. it a little easier. Yeah. Ooh. That's about enough for me. Yeah. That would be enough. <laughs> uh, Hamilton on loop. And then I use. Our stevia. This is yes. our sweetener. This is and our... this a little bit goes a long way with this. Oh, girl, just you a few really drops. You don't need a lot at all because we're also gonna put in some um some uh, some sugar free sweeteners too. Little organic uh, stevia. That was like maybe four drops, little honey drops. You can count them. Yeah. Um, th that is uh organic better stevia from now. We get that on Amazon. And then. I don't know what I want to use today. Hazelnut. This is like our version of our little coffee Sugar shop over here. Caramel. caramel or caramel? Somebody yeah, what do you it. say? Tomato, tomato. I'm going to do French vanilla. Ooh. And you we ordered a, a bar set. And instead of putting these little tops on um, our alcoholic beverages, we are like, let's just use them and put them on our, on our, on our um, sugar-free syrups. Yes, so, and it feels it, like... It feels like we were at that actual coffee bar or something like... I love it. Or something. But okay, let's see. Glub dub, kind of a lot, but you know, who cares? Hey, <laughs> it's a it's the it best up. part of waking up. And then, it's butter in your cup. The best part for me oh, yes. is the heavy whipping cream. You don't like it black? <laughs> no, not really. No, I can't. I <laughs> and I just eyeball it too. And like the more you want, it's just like regular cream. The more you want, the less coffee flavor. But exactly, I think it's, that's up about, you. it's, it's up to you. It's up to you. It's a taste. I don't know how much is in there. It's, it's enough for me. Yeah. <laughs> um. So this. He, you just literally uh, brew your coffee right into the cup. Mm -hmm. It's already all in there, and then you waz it up. So, I do a normal size cup. David does the extra large. And I'm not adding Very any coffee because I usually just um, so, use whatever David has used. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so basically in the morning, I usually make my coffee first. Yeah. But I put like a bunch in there. So yeah. these will, this is like a single serve. Let me turn on the light over here so you guys can see better. So this is like a single serve. But I put a good amount because I like strong coffee. So, for the longest time, he would dump this and yeah. then redo it. And then he was like, wait. I could just use your coffee because yeah. <laughs> he's like, people make a whole pot out of one scoop. And I'm like, 
Why, why are we? Just, why are we throwing away wasting coffee? So, right. So, so he's saving us money. I'm with trying to save us money. Ways. But um, I do a classic brew. I don't know what David does. He may do, maybe he does a rich brew. I like brew. a rich brew. Oh, don't try, I deserve it? Let me try a rich. And it takes like one or two minutes. Yes. And guys, I love our ninja. What coffee maker do you use? Love our ninja. Now, this ninja has like a thing on the side. Uh, a, a wizard. A wazer. Yeah, I use that sometimes. Sometimes. It, it it's works. kind of inconvenient. We used to have it. Uh, we had another... Wazer that wasn't as good as this one. Oh my so gosh. I always use that one instead. And it works. It's convenient, but the cleanup is more. This is easier. <laughs> Seriously. Oh, look guys. So this these are our um our I don't wanna like Magnet. let me see if I can like <laughs> cover some of these. There we go. So these are like the magnets that we have at all times. So Golden Girls. I love the Golden Girls. And look, they're in their like kitchen and you can like play with them. I love it. And these are all the things that we've gotten over our times and our travels. I and feel like we had more. Did we? No. That's all some? of them. No. This is all of them. We traveled more than that. Well, we have, but we started doing magnets later in the in the journey. Okay. Yeah. And then, of course, our door tag from Booze Cruise. And then this is actually from my family. This is from the one the first time we went home. Um, oh, to my family for, yeah. yeah, this is the first time we ever went home to my family's for Christmas. Uh, we got stocking stuffers and, and the stocking surfers, uh, stirfers, stirfers, stirfers. I'm, I'm Celine Dion. <laughs> um, we got a Dana J and I just thought that was, I loved it so much because not everyone can bring their, uh, significant other home to their family and get, you know, <laughs> stuff for them in their stockings. I loved it. Um, yeah, so just gonna let that brew and then we'll come back for the wazin. While his coffee's brewing, I figured I would give you guys a little update on the uh, succulent. A, eh? guys, they've changed so much. This is exactly what I was excited to do with you guys is remember, if you haven't watched that video, there's a video, it's like a shop with me video and I like just lamented over which ones to get and I got ones that had opportunity for other life and other growth because I wanted to see how they would change so this one has gotten these have gotten so big like this one is basically the same but like, it looks the same but it's just a little bit bigger this one is changing like every day like this has gotten so big and all the these were so small and now it's like slowly changing color i don't know if you can see that and then this one this crowning glory i cannot this was just like a tiny little thing that sat atop oh you hear that that's his coffee um that sat atop and then this has gotten huge added all these extra leaves and then this just started opening like yesterday and it's pink isn't it so? Oh, you're such a good baby. You're doing right. so well. So, yeah. the coffee's ready. Yep. Did you waz it? Not yet. But when oh, it comes out, it comes out like that. So comes out pretty like much that. all the butter and Which? the cream and everything's on top. It floats on top, so you want to get that mixed in. This is like what people think that when we say butter coffee, this is what people think we're drinking. No, like, it's, guys, it's that's not. That's disgusting. Wait, do it over here so you can. So we can there's see good it. natural light. Yeah, so this is what it looks like. And fortunately, we were able to find this. It's called a frother, not a wazzer. Yeah, no, it's a frother. We ordered this on Amazon. It was maybe mm -hmm. about. Fifteen dollars or mm -hmm. something. Um, but it's I'll, I'll, I'll link all this. Li I'll link all this this down below. Then uh, I'll link the ninja. I'll I'll link our frother. Yeah, but it's really cool. It works very. Oh my well. god, it works. It has a lot of power behind it. So my favorite one. I usually do this over the sink because it it goes everywhere. Like, don't. Eh, but I'm gonna do it slowly today. So I like to start at the bottom. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Look at that. It's like a boat motor. And then I just kind of like, just do a little couple of presses of it. <gasps> do you work in a coffee shop? <laughs> nah, yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. And you don't, I mean, if I had a bigger cup, I can do it stronger, but I just don't. Uh, oh, but yeah. Babe. But yeah, so you want to get it frothy and mixed in and I'm making sure it's all mixed. Yeah. Because sometimes it can, um, you don't mix well enough and all that butter is just sitting at the top still. You don't so. want that. But it's delicious. Like, literally, this coffee, it does not taste like just like you're having just butter. Like, it's, no. not, it's not like that at all. It's all mixed in very well. It tastes like, like a meal to me. Like, I don't really eat breakfast often. No, and I this, think a lot of like, people yeah, don't. And this is pretty much acts like a meal. And yeah. it's very, like, rich and creamy. And delicious. And frothy. Yeah, frothy. 
Very good. Yay! Very good. Um, also, side note, I know we've mentioned this before, I'm not sure, but these guys, I got these two, I got these from the Dollar Tree, all you have to do is you buy green onions, you put them in water, fill the water, and they grow every, like, I would say every two days, I have new green onions. This is all, like, new growth, so you basically never have to grow I would never have to buy green onions again. And it looks so nice in your kitchen as well. And that's it. Just container with water. I switch out the water pretty often. Like maybe once um, every day or once every other day. Just to make sure that it stays nice and not smelling like onion juice. But it's amazing. It's amazing. I love having uh, the fresh green onions. Even for garnish. All right, you guys, so Jarrell is getting jiggy with it in the kitchen over here. Um, last night we had quesadillas, so this is just like a steak quesadilla that he's making with a little steak, a little <laughs> cheese. And these are, of course, um, low-carb tortillas. Uh, so he's going to make that. Mm -hmm. My goodness, guys, this is momentous. No, it's not momentous. Jarrell, this is the, you're cooking this year. Cook, that. This is like my first time cooking in, in the kitchen. Well, I think I this made, is the first I made, time. No, I made a grilled cheese last week. Oh yeah, you made a grilled cheese. Mm -hmm. Guys, look how cute he looks in a little black mound. Stop it. Look how good it is. <laughs> Babe, it looks good. I'm surprised he didn't put hot sauce or salsa on it, knowing him. I'll put it on the outside. It'll be on the outside. He has a, look at him, he has utensils. Oh, stop. This is... Babe, you have a spatula in your hand? I do. Oh I'm just my. just trying to see he's, how well it is. He's killing the game. Uh -oh. uh, here it goes, here, here it goes. goes. you guys, the flip. Oh, yeah, <laughs> there he is. My little chef boy RD. <laughs> All right, you guys, so it's basically done. It is brown. It's brown, it's cheesy and melty on the inside. I'll cut it so you guys can see. Oh, we gotta but. see the inside. If you guys are wondering, this is conditioner. This conditioner. Listen, right you here. gotta take care of those uh, <laughs> those luscious locks. It dries here, so. <laughs> yes. And tonight, um, I'm we're we have uh, errands and all this stuff to do, so we don't know what time we're getting home. So ahead of time, um, this is actually a, a collie mash that I froze that I made before. It has like bacon and cheese and stuff in it. I'm gonna make a quick. Um, shepherd's pie with uh some canned ground beef i that i did before so ground beef and do some tomatoes and maybe some green beans and then put the collie mash on top and bake it so that's going to be dinner but for now oh my uh, goodness and there it is it's cheesy meltiness i'm obsessed with the <laughs> horror movie butcher knife that you used to i know this. i did <laughs> this is case of tea. Yeah, I'm gonna eat it, but I have to add my salsa. No, no, he has things to do. He has. <laughs> so I'll show you. We'll show you the full, the full shablamo. I think I'm just gonna have you guys saw. If you watched uh, our last video, I did a, um, uh, I did a meal prep, and so I think I'm just gonna eat one of those hot links for Din Din and some. Uh, here I can show you guys. Do 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 do. Oh, in our fridge. Oh, jeez. Nothing. All, all, all keto, all carb stuff. All, if you're wondering what our fridge looks like, it's the most keto. It's keto AF. Um, so, yesterday we did that. This is why it's so good to meal prep ahead of time because you can literally just like, oh gosh, it's hard to do this with one hand. Oh, I'm struggle bussing. Babe, help. Yay. Sorry, my finger was in the way for a second. But yeah, so I'm just gonna have like one of these and maybe some of those sausage balls. Um, That's not my quesadilla, it's good. No, 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 I, 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 we need to eat this. Yeah. And plus look at that deliciousness. Yes, I, I put my sauce in the middle because I like to dip it. No sour oh, yeah. cream, he's weird about like sour, sour cream. cream. I love sour cream. But. Anyway, um, I'll show you what my plate looks like. Taste test. I mean, you made it. Mm-hmm, go. Yay, see this? She gets loud if you leave her open. All right, girl, we hear you, we hear you. Speaking of divas. Oh, Electra. All right, guys, so this is what I'm having for lunch. Basically just a hot link, and this is a piece of that Havarti, which is um, one carb, 
with a piece of keto bread, which is also one carb, and then some sausage balls. So this is roughly, let's see, one, two, three, four. I'd say like five net carbs. So yeah, this is the first meal of the day, and it is 2.58. Okay, guys, so... I started eating, I forgot oh <laughs> that we were God. recording. But um, we have these little elevation bars that we get from Aldi. You saw them in our Aldi. Yeah, you saw them in our shopping small. hall. Um, but this is um, a caramel nut um, chocolate bar. And it, to me, it reminds me of like a Snickers. Yeah, they're so good. Two they're net so carbs. Good. Two net carbs. And um, um, one of our friends is uh, premiering a show tonight. So we are going to um, Jarrell's God Dad's to see it. Um, only uh, one person there because... It's not a party because yeah. social distancing and the time we're in. But when we're there, we're going to bring um, some stuff for charcuterie. So we'll have a little snacky there. So he's having this now. So elevation bars. Elevation bars uh, from, from Aldi. From Aldi. Oh, for All right. So we're headed over there. And <laughs> literally, this is like have board real travel. If you guys remember the stuff that we got from Aldi the other day. So this is all the stuff. Um, these are keto-friendly nuts. Um, were these crackers. We just have on hand in case we have guests um, in order to make the board. So they'll eat the crackers. And then there's some other stuff for us to eat. Dang, if I would have thought about it, I would have made us some keto crackers. But you know what? It's fine. I'm fine. All right, you guys. So sorry about the sun. Um, we are headed um, to my goddad's house. He, he lives pretty much like three minutes away. Yeah, it's so it's a quick drive. We're supposed to be there at 6 and it's like 5.57 and we just left. <laughs> Um, but we're gonna make it on time. But we'll be it's on time. That close. So we're about to go there now, and um, we have our charcuterie. We have our charcuterie. We had a little mishap on the stairs because we didn't have any bags in the house, so we tried to carry everything down. Which is so weird. Normally we have so many grocery bags, but in the move we threw them all away. Yeah. Do you guys keep your grocery bags and repurpose them? We use them actually for as trash liners for smaller trash cans, like in the bathroom and stuff. And I use them in the car, but we threw them all away. And, well, we recycled them. Um, oh yeah, it's bright, huh? It's very bright. We're but, it's fine. But, um, so, anyway, so we dropped the cheese, and it was spilling all over. It's, it was, um, mozzarella. Yeah, but, but we saved it. Flipped um, it upside down. Saved it, flipped it upside down. It's still gonna be good. Yeah, So, yeah, but that's what we are doing. Yeah, we are. Alright. All right. Bye. See you soon. Guys, the new Gaga and Ariana Grande, Rain On Me, how much do we love it? We love it a lot. So love good. It. Have you heard it? can't play too much. Well, I'm not paying Gaga or Ariana. You're so very, very... here's the charcuterie board that we put together. Um, some keto ingredients, some non-keto ingredients, obviously. So I think I have a video on uh, putting together a charcuterie board on Booze Life. I'm going to transfer it over so you guys can see it. But the basic ideals is that you want to have different levels, um, high to low, also several different cheeses. You want a hard cheese, a soft cheese, something fresh, and usually a blue or something with mold in it. So there's different types of uh meat here there's regular spiced um these are all salamis with the pepperoni and then this is our fresh our blue is going to be in the olives this is uh, one of our harder cheese because it's an extra sharp cheddar and we have a gouda it's waxed and then these nuts are roasted so all of this is keto except for the crackers obviously because other people are here and we have martinis which are also keto as long as you are not doing it with anything sugar inside of it so Yay! So I, so I used yeah. all of the olives yeah. on the tray, but look, leftover olive juice, martinis, girl. Not for me. Do you like, is this, ugh, I don't like olives and I definitely don't want a martini olive, but for those of you who do, don't throw this away because you can get lit. All right, you guys. So we are just getting in and it's late. It's like, it's late. I'm like I'm changing something. clothes. Yeah. It's 11. We're at my goddad's. We have the best. I know. Um, we had a, a charcuterie that he made, and yeah. he also um, oh, uh, I probably shouldn't say. It. Never mind. I was gonna say <laughs> something. What cocktails? No, he's running for mayor and all this. Oh stuff. yes, and he is. Oh, that's yeah. But they don't know. It's, they don't know. I'm I'm, I'm it's, not it was doing a, the was social a... media for his like. My goddad's running for mayor. I'm doing the social media for his like thing. Right, and which is it, like a huge thing. It's a huge thing. So it was like a big celebration. It's a big celebration is what we're saying that we had. So we had a great time, and we also had watched the show that one of my god dad's friends was starring in. Yes. Um, that premiered tonight, so we did that. Yeah. 
so but, it, was a, it was a pretty cool night. We don't get out a lot, especially during this pandemic. Well, no, like that's and that's one of the things too is like we went there because they also don't go out and it's his, his yeah. family and there's only four of us. Only four um, of so us. we were like, you know, um, by ourselves. It wasn't like a party I, right. well you guys saw it wasn't a party at all but i say all that to say is that i think one of the last things you guys saw was us taking out the um uh, cauliflower mash to make shepherd's pie but we ate the um charcuterie now we're like not we're not hungry, hungry. at all yeah so i put I'm, it i can't eat anything yeah but we I, can make it we can you can make it tonight for breakfast in the morning no, no, I just put the call. I just it defrosted. Yeah. I put it in the fridge. Um, we'll have it for dinner tomorrow. Um, but we just wanted to let you know we're done eating because it was like a what we ate in a day and also a hangout right. with us. So we love you. Love you guys. Thank you for spending spending another day with us. I on know. Our daily keto. Um, what we eat in a day. What we eat in a day. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so much for uh, oh, watching. Shops. It's. At Booze Cruise at B O O S C R U I Z Cruise, you're worth it. E, we love you.